Previously on Pokemon Sword. Wild Flygon, wow. Nope. Tick tock. A wild matchup. I have a feeling this guy is at level 60. Boink! Nice! <laughs> Hello YouTube, welcome back! So we are finally going to continue our journey in Pokemon Sword. As you can see here, we already have the Pokedex at 244 caught and seen at 309. I spent a lot of time in the wild area and I think it's time for us to proceed to the story. And our next goal is to go to the train station in Hammerlock, which is here. Wait up, Kindred, I'm coming too. I had Raihan beat in no time. Once I got my head on straight and stopped doubting every decision I made, that is. <laughs> And you never stop nattering on through the entire battle. You're pretty different from the champion in that. But your strength is genuine, as proven by the dragon badge you won from me. You came at me with all the force of a raging storm, and even I was blown away. Listen up, you two. Battle your way through the Champion Cup tournament to face Leon. One of you ought to. I reckon I'm still the favorite to win, but I'm up against my true rival, Kindred. So I'll ring out every last thing I learned during my battle with you, Raihan, to beat him. So get a move on, Kindred. The train's waiting. Windon? Hmm. Windon Stadium where the whole of Galar know the whole world is gonna be watching us. The end is near. You and me are gonna make our match there the greatest match that ever was. Okay, so we're here. Hey, I wonder what Siri would appear if all the snow on Route 10 melted away. Oh, the train is fully functional again. So this is Route 10. It's like a wall made out of snow. Bet there'll be ice-type Pokemon crawling out of the woodwork in a place like this. Come on, Kindred. Recon will be able to train ourselves up to new heights here before the Champion Cup starts. I believe in myself and the Pokemon on my team, and I know we'll all get loads stronger. So I'm off. See you in Windzone, mate. See you there. Two X attacks. Okay, so there's Miss Mr. Mime here, but we already already have a Mr. Rhyme. So no need. Plus we should just focus on making our way through the through to Windon. Gardevoir? What level? Forty-five. Okay. Crunch is only effective because of the fairy typing of Gardevoir. So let's just go with. Let's go with Crunch. Okay, that hurts. That hurts. I think Dreadnought can still take one Dazzling Glim. 
but I will need to switch out after this. Oh wait. I think it's it's gonna get buffeted by Hill. So he will faint. Oh never mind. He only had a Gardevoir. If he had another Pokemon then Injuredna would have fainted. Uh-huh. Let's go with Energy Root. Do we have the amulet coin on Kindred? No? Okay. He's holding it. So far, he is the lowest level Pokemon on my team, so. I'll try to make him catch up with the others. Although for the most part, he is just substitute for my Gyarados. I don't think we can take out Steelix with one Razor, razor Shell because of its defense. Okay, we can use Protect. We can use to we can use Protect to. Protect ourselves from dig. I think this guy only has a Steelix. Wait, no. He has another. Mudsdale? Okay. Another Pokemon with a high defense stat. Not to mention, its defense will keep on rising every turn. Every turn, if you keep on using a move that makes physical contact? Not sure if it. Not sure if it requires physical contact. No need slam. No need slam for surfetch. Hmm, there's another Galarian Mr. Mime here. Let's continue on battling trainers. I don't have my starter Pokemon on my team because she's already at level 54. I used Grod a lot on catching a bunch of Pokemon in the wild area because of false swipe. Neutral damage because of water type, despite Dread not being a rock type. By the way, during some time in the wild area, I also sent my main team to Pokejobs. Pokejobs which increases specific stats. Basically increase some of the stats effort values. Like for Gyarados, I sent I sent Gyarados to, to a Pokejob seminar which increases the speed EVs and the attack effort values. Alright, so now we have a better physical water move for Kindred No. Liquidation. It's now gonna start packing more punch. Hmm. I don't think I have this Pokemon yet, but like what I said earlier. Catching is not our priority at the moment. Or v -Knight. Okay. Depending on the level, this may be... Quite tough. Because Corviknight has a high defense stats. Has a high defense stat. 
Just gonna go for liquidation. Hmm. At least it lowered its defense. And with that swagger, we can definitely feign Corviknight on the next turn, assuming assuming Kindred no can attack it. Otherwise, I have a feeling Kindred no will feign, but it's gotta believe, right? It's gotta believe at Kindred no. Okay, good. Can keep on going because of the boosted attack. Tugger boosts the attack of the opposing Pokemon by two stages, by the way. That's why when your Pokemon is hurt due to the confused due, due to it due to it being confused, it will inflict more damage. Hmm. Liquidation. Oh. Let's go for the liquidation. Uh-huh. That's bad. I forgot about Earth Power. Okay, against Flygon, Ground and Dragon type. Ground and Dragon. Just use Mr. Rhyme and one hit it with Freeze Dry. Okay, so this Flygon has Earth Power and Earthquake. That was actually a wise move from an AI because it targeted Mr. Rhyme's lower defense stat, which is defense, physical defense. Whereas if he used Earth Power, it, it would only deal little damage. Anyway, I need to revive Kindred now first. Let's battle every trainer here. Eliper? Okay. Water and flying type. We can use Rock Tomb. Oh, Drizzle, okay. That will remove the hail and change the weather to rain. I'm faster than Pelipper? That doesn't make sense. Tailwind, okay. Now he is faster. Water Pulse. Don't tell me you're gonna get confused. Okay, nope. You're doing fine so far. Sir Zing at level 15. Explosion. Nope. Don't need that. Don't need that. Noctone. Rocktomb should do the job. Okay, so... Nactor can learn Moonblast. Interesting. Whenever I see a Nactal, I remember that Pokemon episode where Ash caught a shiny Nactal. I wanna catch that, but no, 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 no. Let's battle this trainer first. Should we go Pokemon camping? Pokemon camp? No! Actually, let's camp first. Want to know the secret to making a stellar dish of curry? Adding regions and berries that are hard to come by. They had something special. Not only could find the most legendary of ingredients, the Fireball Gigantamax. Hmm. I have that ingredient. Anyway, 
Let's stay here for a bit. And interact with the other Pokemon, I suppose. Oh, that's a Galarian Rapidash. Try calling it. I don't have this Pokemon because it's a version exclusive. Anyway, it looks really good. He also has a Galarian. Galarian Farfetch'd. Galarian Wheezing. And Galarian Mr. No, no, I mean Mr. Rhyme. Mr. Rhyme. I guess only one of my Pokemon sent out in this camp. Anyway. Enough playing. Time to cook, curry. No, not that. Uh, menu. Cooking. Let's cook. Let's cook with Tristan. Use rare ingredients. Hmm. Danlon berry. And let's put a lot of citrus. We, yeah, we have a lot of citrus berries. And then... Two Kelpsy berry. Two Kelpsy berries. So what's going to be the main ingredient? Tristan? Oh, what is that? Bone? Looks like a bone. Okay, we gotta be careful with the flames because we have another we have another person fanning it. Okay. Okay, that's good. I mean, he steers really slow. Right on time. Wonder what kind of curry. Dry bone curry. Okay, guess it's superb. Dry bone curry. Paraha class. Okay, that restored our Pokemon's HP. Time to resume our journey. Also, that leveled up. Kindred, no? To level 49. Oh god. Didn't mean to interact with this Vertic. Anyway, level 55. Should it faint? Okay. We can use one more Rakhtum. Oh Jesus. I just came from a Pokemon camp. Okay, superpower. Let's use Surzing. I don't have any Pokemon with me that can put it to sleep. Never mind, it used rest. This is a pain. I wanted to just keep... I wanted to just battle trainers. And leave the catching later. Anyway, we're here so... Might as well. So I don't like the idea that it will keep on using rest. We can use one more strange steam. It's 
gonna wake up. Why did we go first? Another rest? Okay, sure, cord. Okay. Missed. Let's use an Ultra Ball. Hope one is enough. Okay. That's another added to our Pokedex. We now have 200. We now have 245. Or caught, I think. 49. I'll just get Kindred onto level 50 and then switch to Gyarados. Hiker Donald Gigalith High defense stat Okay Tan stream That's better for us Ride on. One liquidation should be enough. Because Ride on is ground and rock type. This man wants to learn the move Theater Dance. Nope. I don't need Theater Dance. If you don't know what Zero Dance is, it's basically a move that confuses all the Pokemon around you, including your teammate. You're playing doubles, that is. Uh -huh. Let's just keep on going. Gentleman Glenn. Darmanitan. Okay. I don't have this one yet. Galarian Dermonitan. Ice type? Or ice fighting? We will see. If Rockthom doesn't deal super effective damage, okay. Rockthom is super effective against Dermonitan, which means it's your ice type. Okay. Injured is now level 50. I'll send in Gyarados back on my team. I'll put Gyarados back on my team. Okay, fighting type is not a good match for Kindred. No. Mm. Let's go with Liquidation anyway. Dead. Okay, against fighting type, we can use Mr. Rhyme or Sir Zing, or even even Madame Duck. Uh, let's just make it quick and use Weezing. Forgot the ability of this Pokemon. Wait, you have another one? How many do you have? Six? <laughs> Grab lock, okay. 
Another fighting type, if I'm not mistaken. Okay, we're still faster. Whoa! We got 18,000 Poké Dollars from this guy. Uh, okay. Take a break first, Kindred, no? And let Gyarados handle things from here. Okay, so is this a double battle? Uh, Gyarados and Mr. Rhyme? 51, 50. There's an electric type in the opposing team who will take care of it. A Berserker. Currently have Choice Band. Let's go with Berserker. You know what, since I used Berserker in a battle. Clean Clan in Heliolisk. Okay. I knew it. An electric type. I think Berserker will do just fine. But I doubt Gyarados. Uh, if this Pokemon has the dry skin ability. Couldn't be affected by the waterfall. Uh, should we go for a crunch? And then go with Iron Head for Perserker. Who will go first? Okay, thank god. Thank god it missed. At least that's less problem for Gyarados. Noivern. You can use Ice Fang against Noivern, and then I think Ice Fang can paint it. Well, Gyarados goes first anyway, so... Seriously! Stop using an electric type move against Gyarados! Alright, good job. I'm a bit afraid of that Zap Cannon. Okay, we will see how much damage Iron Head does. Hmm. It's a lot. Despite not being despite not being very effective. Thanks to Top Claws and Choice Band. Anyway, I'll switch Gyarados to Mr. Rhyme. And let's just continue on using Iron Head. Choice banded Iron Head. Okay, good call. But that's going to paralyze Mr. Rhyme. Zap Cannon has a really low accuracy, but if it manages to hit your Pokemon, it will be paralyzed 100%. Plus, it does quite, quite, quite a damage. So, get okay, Zemaru. As far as I know, this one is still type. Wait, still type, so let's switch to Duck. Just keep on using Iron Head or Perserker. Zing Zap. What does it do?
Iron Barbs. First Pokemon, it hurts the Pokemon which makes contact on it. First impression, let's just, let's just go with Brick Break. Another Zing Zap. That actually hurts. Oh, flinch! Okay. You activated. You activated Madame's duck ability steadfast. Oh boy. That's gonna hurt Berserker again. Level 52. That was a good match. Oh, we're finally here. Are we finally here? No more trainers? Okay. The only way is forward. We're finally at Windon. Now this is quite an enormous city. We will have to check everything, every store, every place, see what can, and see what we can get. Alright, Hop. How excited are you? Alright, Windon City. This is the place where I become a legend at last. You get it, don't you, mate? After all, I'm about to become the new champion of the Galar region. That's it. I'm headed straight for Windon Stadium. Don't waste too much time, Kingsred. You should head there yourself. Already, Hop? I want to roam around first. So you go ahead. Well, it's mud still. Hello, kid. You're a Charizard? Okay, you're a Charizard. Fine. Good day. Good day to you as well. Mr. Mime. This Mr. Mime's name is Marcel. It's really amazing. Taking pictures. Well, that Pokemon is always smiling, so... Proceeding, you have to sign up eventually, right? In the same way, even if you're defeated, sooner or later you'll get back on your feet. Wise words. You can, you can, you can tell Lee Yun absolutely loves the battle. Just look at his smile. Better to raise it from a Charmander. You'll form a stronger band that way. Your very own Charizard. Take the lady's advice. Hey, I'd like to invite some of the fine trainers flourishing in Galar back to my own region. From what region are you? Because you just said back to your own region. I came all the way from Unova, so I might as well give everything a try, including Poké Jobs. There's a Rotom in, Rotom in that machine. What can we buy from this? Okay. Luxury ball, quick ball, repeat ball, and the vitamins. Still have 20. Okay, no need to restock. Alright guys, this episode will be ending here. Next episode, look forward to exploring... What's the name of this town again? Windon. Look forward to exploring Windon and... If it's... I mean, if we can explore it really quick, then we will go immediately to the Windon Stadium. Anyway, it was really fun going through Routen. 
all the trainer battles, we even managed to add one Pokemon to one Pokemon to our Pokedex. So yeah, this will be it. Thank you for watching, guys. I'll see you in the next episode.